We're coming to you live from Tombstone, Arizona. It's sold out Chimera Stadium. This is global warming at its finest, folks. It's a scorching 116 degrees today, but thankfully, it's a dry heat. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Los Scandalous Dam take on the Cardinal Sins. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> you <pancake dummy. laughs> if you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cat litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish! I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They had the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. Tim, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Third down and, well, good luck. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice cap, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy. Oh, with a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to made it the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. <laughs> and they'll line up for the punt here. One. Let's see if they can get a return. And he digs the punt and looks for open. Back, my friends, was an all pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. And the defense gives up five yards there.
Second down and five. Oh, and he intercepts the ball. Thank you very much, Justin. The oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. First and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. It looks like the lineman wanted to get the ball a high five. Then he did, Bricks. Then he did. Second down and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Third down and five. He refuses to go down. And he breaks away. Oh, man, that worm just ate the player alive. You got to... And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First down and one. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. Second down and six. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's 
It's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. This guy's a brick shit house. He rifled that one in there and they come up with 10 yards on the play. Third and two. Ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> First and two. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pick. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they had raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two. He really wants it. You're like a monkey trying to they go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. I know I said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Jimmy passes it for maybe a yard. They've got to open up the offense here, Bricks. Third down and nine. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. You ever get hit in the head with a photo, Grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. Bring up second and one. Oh man, what a throw! That sonic blast. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down.
First down and three. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Second down and six. You can tell he's a berserker because he's broken. Oh, man. But you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. Third and four. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about Sham. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Hmm. I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned NFL rule. <laughs> Third and two. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, oh crowd's loving it. Bring up third and one. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, it's all those power and friends like a high cool. Yo, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Second down and ten. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. I don't Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. And Bricks, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for a sandwich. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Now the offense is getting kills. This is 
really a violent game, guys. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my face. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. And it's first and ten. He's not going down. First down. He was not going to drop that. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. Now the QB is dinking and dunking the defense to sleep. <laughs> One yard on that pass. Second down and nine. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid mark. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck! And it's first and ten. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense couldn't do anything to stop a throw that good, man! You mean aside from driving the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Uh, oh, I can't believe it ain't the whole thing. Drop, drop, fizz, fizz. Someone give that guy some Balka Schmelzer. First and ten. And it's just like the Fourth of July, only with blood and guts. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. First and ten. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. First and ten. He can go all the way. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. Here comes the defense. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First down and one. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? 
No, no, Brick, don't get me taken. Return for, you know what? Never mind. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, yeah, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Red, I kill him. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. <laughs> the offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleety. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about bad hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. They are, but sometimes the defense thinks they're helping out in their own special way. Second down and long. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after. Oh, that worm grabbed him by the head and didn't let go. And the worm's gone in the bathroom, Grim. Why did it just crap dirt, you think? Now you're just talking a lot of crap right now. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. The defense knocked a pass down, and quarterbacks hate that. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show, sponsored by Monsatan Industries, makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to start as the teams take the field. This game has been one lopsided route. Yeah, football games are kind of like boobs. Big or small, they're both great. Except for when they're lopsided. <laughs> when you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pig. 
Lindgren. You're right. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And it's first and ten. It's two-yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else combined. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you're mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. And it's first and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. And they line up for the extra point. right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. didn't see it. At least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses. And he breaks away. Is he dead? Uh, nah, he's still moving. Crap. I had money on him biting a big one. If he don't die soon, my loan shot is gonna kill me. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Pick him. What if interceptions kind of... He broke free and has open field in front of him. They might catch him. Oh, yeah, bingo. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo grip. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. <laughs> and it's first and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go. First and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Second down and ten. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust! In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Brick. The Cardinal Sins get crushed and lose by forfeit. Someone get more body bags. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan passion.
question. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Balin read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack and...